All right, so we just arrived at the, we're parking, like a bit outside Fraser, Colorado. It's Byers Peak. Yeah, it's gonna be a dope one. About to start walking in, so yeah, let's get to it. All right, so we just started walking along the road. Planning on staying along this creek, but we're crossing the forest service over there. So once we make it past there, we'll be good. But until then, I'll update you boys once we're past, because technically camping's not allowed right now. So we just gotta get past this building. Then we got this whole area to ourselves. Oh. All right, so we made it past the forest services, and now we're just gonna be uh, hiking along this road. Probably for a bit, like an hour or so, and then I'll update you boys once we're gonna cut off and go in the trees and go a bit higher up. You walking? You look sick. So we hiked about four miles on like the more paved trail, the wider road. But uh, now we're just going to the thinner and deeper stuff. It doesn't really have any tracks. With, and that's why we didn't really bring snowshoes because we thought we were going to be hiking on the bigger trail for a while. But now we're on the smaller one without snowshoes. So we're just going to have to toughen it out. It's going to be a grind. All right, so we're still walking through the thicks of it. It's been pretty brutal. We're almost at two miles on this tiny ass trail. It's just been really deep. So the boys are all kind of struggling. But um, we're looking to find like a big opening where we can just set up camp for the night. Cause we're all starting to get pretty tired. Cause we've been almost gone six miles now. All right, so these boys may have just seen, we found our uh, campsite for the night we got running water so we all can filter our water and refill it a lot of dead wood to start a fire so we're just gonna end up camping camping down here all right so now we got to cross the creek probably the sketchiest part because we fall in we're kind of just screwed for the night like we're actually just screwed so all the boys just have to be really careful on this sketchy ass creek crossing all right and here the boys go only goal is to not fall in not trying to wreck our nights this would really end us all right Oh. Oh, <laughs> oh my god, Carl, you're so wet. <laughs> Did you get on camera? Oh, f**k. Jesus Christ. I just fell through. I actually just fell through. We're going to be camping right down here, so we're just going to start setting up camp. And get some nice montage shots of that. We're deep inside the Colorado backcountry. This is dope. Got the creek right over there. So yeah, let's get to it. It wouldn't survive anyway. Oh, 
Great Lord. All right, so we're about done with cutting all the wood down. So now we're just getting the fire ready over there. And we cut down a lot of wood, so we should be good to get us through the night. All right, so we're just finishing getting camp set up. Once it gets colder, we're gonna lay out the tarp and just lay our sleeping bags all out here with some sleeping pads. And we're just finishing up the fire set up. Got the benches and all the wood. Probably just start setting her up once the sun goes down further because we're still getting a lot of heat from the sun, so that's nice. All right, the sun is starting to go down. It's on the peak of the mountain, so we started the fire build. Turn them off. Little did we know, Carl might actually voice the party. All right, we figured we need some more wood for the fire because she's eating wood right now. So we found this really tall, dead tree. She's about to fall. Get out, get out, get out. All right, so the sun is completely down and it's getting cold. We're looking at a temperature uh, pretty much 10 degrees right now. All right, about to start cooking some dinner. We got some glizzy or hot dogs. All right. Out of all the dinners being made tonight, I'm most Now they're gonna cook. cook. Oh yeah. Nice and hot. We are. And now a struggle, boys. Got in water at night. It's like freaking zero degrees. <laughs> oh, yes. And oh, make sure you don't fall in. Oh. through. Oh yeah, that is sketchy. Oh, Getting wet right now is yeah. deep bad. Yeah. <laughs> if you get your hand in now, you're toast. It's actually so cold out. It's crazy. Oh, these feet are cold. No, wow. Just after sweating all day and stuff, they're like no, frozen. Well, yeah. Feels so nice out by the fire. All right, so we just finished setting up our shelter, or not really shelter, just camp for the night. Completely out under the stars and the big trees. We all got some really nice warm sleeping bags, that should be nice, but uh, got a little pad too, just on a tarp. But um, we're looking at a temperature of about negative one or two degrees, so it's gonna be a real cold and gritty one, boys. Like, it's gonna be beyond cold. So uh, yeah, it's no joke, deep inside the Colorado backcountry, and, yeah, this is no joke, gonna be a cold ass night. All right, boys, we're about to go to bed. Got all the water bottles inside the same bag so they don't freeze. All right, what's up, boys? I don't think you all understand how truly cold out it is. This is, it's actually insane, boys. Like, it's just crazy. It's like, we're so, we're so cold already. We just laid down. Tonight's gonna be actually a grind. So I'll just update you boys in the morning, but it's gonna be so gritty. This is actually crazy.
just chilling on the campfire, trying to get some life back in my feet. Especially after last night, that was crazy. They've been numb for so long. Probably all just gonna try to warm up on the fire and then pack up camp and then head out because it is so damn cold. Great All right, we just finished cleaning up camp. Looking nice and clean. So we're about to head out. We still got the creek crossing and then we're just on the trail. Probably like six miles again. So yeah, let's get to it. Do you want it? No. I'll tell you what I'm talking All right, we just got back, back of the truck. All the boys are pretty tired after that long night last night, so we're all pretty glad, glad to be back, especially after the long walk. And uh, yeah, that's pretty much it, so just thanks for watching.